Welcome to the channel to Irrational. I am Pranay Sharma and in this video we are going to talk about the changes IFOA Institute is making in conducting the examinations from April 2025. We'll discuss all the information given by the institute and also what does it mean for us. Let's talk about the information that is relayed to us by the institute itself. The institute is introducing a new exam platform and the reasons that they have relayed to us are very straightforward. First, they say that this is the next step in digital first exams. This will help them enhance the security and keep the integrity of the examination high. This will allow them to have remote invigilation during the examination. And they will also introduce a simple way of identity verification through this new exam platform. So how does this actually work? IFOA is going to introduce a new specialist software that is going to help them invigilate during your examination through the webcam and the mic of your laptop or your computer. They will also be able to monitor your online activity during the examination and your exam activities will be recorded that they can analyze later on. So this was from the institute's point of view. Now let's discuss what changes for us. First, let's talk about the technical requirements that the students will have to meet. You will need a laptop or a computer with webcam as well as mic. You will require a very reliable internet connection during your examination so that they can invigilate through your webcam and your mic. Broadband connection is definitely recommended. I would not suggest you to conduct your examination using your mobile internet. The basic softwares that we require for our examination are not going to change. So you will require MS Word, Excel, RStudio depending on your examination. And also you will require the PDF reader and a file extractor something like WinZip or WinRAR or 7-Zip or something like that. And that specialist software will be provided by the IFOA. The minimum specification of your computer would be relayed by IFOA soon. They have not released such information yet. As soon as that information comes out, I will let you know by writing it in the description down below. Other than the technical requirements, there will be some things that we will have to take care during our examination. The first thing is going to be the photo ID card. So you will have to keep a photo ID with you during your examination. You will require an isolated environment because these specialist softwares are very sensitive to the sounds. You cannot have your family members going in and out of your room or you cannot have this examination in your office where there might be other people working around you. So you will need an isolated environment for those three, three and a half hours of your examination. Now the biggest question that is going to come to your mind right now is going to be what are the changes in the examination pattern itself. So there is no change in examination pattern. It is still an open book examination. You can refer to your materials that you have. It may be a reference book or a material that you have created for yourself. In previous examinations, they have allowed us complete online access, but that may change. They said that they are reviewing their online access policy and they would inform us very soon. And I will definitely let you know. Now the final question remains, what should change for your studies? I would suggest there should not be cha any changes in your study pattern. Exam pattern is not changing. It is still an open book examination. So make your reference material as you would before. Make sure that if you are directly quoting a material, you should reference it to avoid plagiarism. If you want to know how to avoid plagiarism, I have already made a video on it. I will leave it in the description. And finally, these changes are going to happen from April 2025. So there is no change in the pattern of your examination for this September 2024 examination. If you have any questions about this, please leave it in the comments. I will reply it as soon as possible. If you like this video, do like and share with others. I will see you in the next one.